All right, now we're going to show you how to convert a file from your from your Olympus recorder um, into an MP3. Um, you take your Olympus recorder and you plug it in with a USB, as I'll plug in right now. And on your desktop, in a second, a little uh, folder should pop up right here, DS40, or yours might say DS30. If you have the um, DSS player installed, um, some software may launch and that software will let you listen to and copy over your um, audio files. If you don't have it installed, then you can just manually double click on the file and that will bring up your uh, folders. See here there's DSS folder A, B, C, D and when I recorded on my recorder I had an option to record into folder A, B, C. I know that the, f the clip I want is here in C so I'll point to C and I know that it was the third file so I will just take this now and I will copy it to my desktop and I'll close I'll uh, eject my Olympus because I don't need it anymore and uh, alright so here is my file now you could upload this just as it is to the web and we could edit it but if say you want to snip it down a bit you uh, will need to edit it now, the program we use for editing is called Audacity, but Audacity unfortunately can't open a WMA file. You have to convert it into an MP3 um, or into something that Audacity can open. There's a number of different programs to do this. There's one called Switch, which you have to buy. Um, iTunes can actually do it, but it's a little complicated. Um, I use um, MPEG Stream Clip, just like for videos. So you take it, drag it, Actually, you can't drag it. You have to open Stream Clip first. Go to File, Open Files. By default, it only looks at video files. And it doesn't know that WMA is an audio. So you have to go to All Files. Select your WMA. Open. And now hit Play. Testing, testing. There we go. There's our audio file. So now I'm going to... I have to convert this into something that Audacity is able to open. So I go File. Unfortunately, very unfortunately, um, MPEG Stream Clip won't let you save as an MP3. If it did, that would make life a lot easier. But we're going to go Export Audio. And our options are as an AIFF, which is uncompressed, it's like a WAV file, uncompressed audio, or an MP4 AAC. Um, AAC is kind of like the Apple version of a MP3. Um, any Mac will be able to play it, but not all PCs can open it. So because we're editing this in Audacity, we're going to go AIFF, hit OK. Where do you want to save it? Save it to the desktop, click Save. There, that converted it. Now we can close Stream Clip. So now, instead of our WMA file, we have this file here called an AIFF. A -I -F -F. I can take that file and I can drag it into Audacity right here, let go, and it opens up. Now, very quick briefer on um, Audacity, there's other tutorials for it, but basically you, um, turn up my volume, basically you, um, by default here, this little thing is called the selection tool, I click and now I've moved my cursor here, if I hit play, testing, testing. <coughs> One, two, three, test, test. There, I can listen to it. Now, I deliberately coughed right here as an example of how you can edit stuff. I hit play. Testing, testing. <coughs> this part right here I don't want. I can use my, using my selection tool, I can click here, move over to the right, and now this area here is a darker gray, that area is now selected. I can hit delete on the, my keyboard, or go edit, delete and now I've taken that cough out go back to the beginning hit play testing testing one two three oh but you see there's a pause here too I'll cut that out hit the delete key move my cursor back to the beginning hit play testing testing one two three test test there now my audio file is the way I want it um, say again this was a three minute interview I could snip off the beginning snip off the end um, if I need to zoom in or zoom out, right here there's a zoom in or a zoom out. Um, 
And yeah, there's other Audacity tool, uh, tutorials you could take, uh, but those are just the basics of, of editing the audio. Now, just simply go to File, Export, and uh, select MP3, and push Save. And this thing will chug along. I think it's done already. And um, here's my MP3. So now you have a uh, MP3 file that you can upload. Again, you could have, if you wanted to just upload raw, you could just upload this WMA file. But if you want to play with it a bit, if you want to edit it a little bit yourself, um, that's the process to go from a WMA file into Audacity and then edit it.